So now we're basing the figures, uh, four figures on 40 by 40s. Then you get some uh, dry decks sparkling and you just put that on the base to create a nice texture which in turn will turn white at once it dries out. And then I'll just put some glue on the edges and throw some sand on it with rock. That way I'll have a nice um, edge for them and I'll spray some in the, some in the middle too. Uh, this is what it looks like as I put them in the production line and then I'm ready to paint that. The way I paint it I just use this paint that I bought from Hobby Lobby, uh, dark brown. Uh, I just put uh, the paint all over the base. Then I go with the second coat to make it a little lighter and then I use um, a third and final, this is the second coat that I use, a little lighter. And then the last one is just a bleach bone to give it more of a really bright look to it. So this is the final uh, stage of painting for the bases. I know people do it a different ways, but this works for me. Uh, once that's done, I can start uh, preparing the bases for putting some um, uh, flocking and grass. But um, here's uh, all the lines that I was able to do. So four battalions is showing three, but this is the static grass that I will use. Um, what I usually always do is just do one base to see how it's going to look like, and then I can make modifications based uh, on the final product, whether I like it or not. And then I'll add some additional uh, bigger rocks or bigger grass uh, to, to make it a little more, uh, to make it nicer. Uh, so it stands out. I'll use the army painted uh, Highland stuff, or I can do something else too, right? Whatever you desire, flowers or whatever. Um, the static grass uh, goes pretty fast. As you can see, once I decided to go with that look, I just started doing it. Uh, some Elmer glue. You can apply the Elmer glue directly into the base, or you can just apply it like I'm doing it, which is just a brush uh, adding little by little so it, it sprays where you want it to uh, your choice I decided to do it this way um, my way is not the correct way it's just the way I do it right then the grass you can do it uh, you can immerse the base into a larger tub with all the static grass on it but then it gets all over the figure you have to clean the figure so what I usually do I just grab tweezers and I just put it in there slowly um, then uh, make sure that it covers everything it packs into it really good so it's not a single fine layer remove the excess and that's what you have there for uh, for your bases right so that's uh, one done and you continue doing it until the entire army is completed anyway uh, thanks for watching uh, hope you guys liked it and then if you have any comments uh, or questions feel free free to uh, leave them and I'll, uh, or suggestions on how to do it. I would appreciate it. Thank you. You guys have a great day.